Lamborghini Rivuelto. The Lamborghini Rivuelto Spanish pronunciation review to is a mid-engine plug-in hybrid sports car produced by the Italian automobile manufacturer Lamborghini. It was officially unveiled on March 29, 2023, as a successor to the Aventador it has a bigger cabin, bigger headroom, and larger elbow space for maximum comfort for the driver and passenger. The Rivuelto features a new hybrid driving mode Citta which stands for City in Italian. This driving mode reduces the power of the car for daily usage and extra comfort while in the city. Rivuelto has a redesigned monitor, which shows the state of charge, energy recovery, and how much battery there is. It also displays what music the driver listening to when the battery, fuel usage separates on the left and right side of the monitor. From the passenger's view, the car features a small display that monitors the speed, gear, and the car's state. The Rivuelto has a monocoque made entirely of carbon fiber making it 10% lighter than the Aventador's chassis. Bayonet's Turismo Hoverbike The hoverbike is designed for use in adverse natural conditions. It will also be able to fly over water. Japanese company Airwinds Technologies took part in development of a flying motorbike. The body of Sturismo hoverbike is made of carbon fiber, which is used in the aviation and space industries. The weight of the aircraft was 300 kilograms. A full tank is enough to fly at 80 kilometers per hour for 40 minutes. The flying motorbike was powered by a Kawasaki racing engine with 230 horsepower. It is assisted by four electric motors. The motorcycle reaches a maximum flight altitude of 20 meters. Cirrus Aircraft Unless you are brand new to general aviation or have been under a rock for the past decade, you know by now the Cirrus design story. Wisconsin brothers Dale and Alan Klapmeyer started building kit airplanes, but soon recognized that the real market was for a new generation mainstream certificated airplane. In 1995, they announced, with much fanfare, that they were going to produce just such an airplane. The airframe would be composite and incorporate the latest thinking in aerodynamics and survivability. Unusual doors that lift upward and forward actually, in the mock-up they were sliding doors like your minivan has, opening to a wide and comfortable cabin. The plan was to incorporate the latest avionics and engine management systems to reduce pilot workload and improve situational awareness and deliver it all at a higher value than was then available in the market. Da Vinci She Surgical System the Da Vinci robot features multiple arms that are capable of performing maneuvers and rotations beyond the natural ability of the human hand. At all times, these arms are controlled by the surgeon who sits just a few feet away at the control center. A high-definition camera relays a live video feed of the operative area back to the surgeon in 3D. Using the Da Vinci surgical system can reduce surgeon fatigue while enhancing the doctor's vision, precision, and control. At no point in the procedure does the robot ever make decisions or act independently of the surgeon. Your surgeon remains in complete control from the very beginning to the very end of your robot-assisted procedure. Salt Lake Regional is an accredited center of excellence in robotic surgery. As the first facility in the state to bear this accreditation, we strive to raise the overall quality of care for patients throughout Utah who may benefit from robot-assisted surgery.
Grab Shell Grab Shell PC Keyboard Controller Japan-based Bravo Co. unveils the Grab Shell, an innovative transforming PC keyboard and controller that can be used for productivity, coding, as well as gaming. This fully programmable mechanical keyboard comes equipped with a joystick, trackball, and device switching function. It's compatible with both wired and wireless setups. Grab Shell can be used while standing up, walking around while typing or even when taking a call. This keyboard gives boasts the technology, flexibility, and versatility to give users virtual control over their productivity as well as experience. Priced at $299 US dollars, normally $399. Agility Robotics Digit Agility Robotics first introduced the once headless digit in 2020, marketing the machine as useful in a wide range of industries such as logistics, industrial inspection, and telepresence. The bot's also been made to work in the same area and take up the same amount of space as humans, which is why it measures 5 feet, 9 inches tall and walks on two legs. A company spokesperson tells TechCrunch that its sensor-equipped head should make it easier for humans to understand Digit's actions, as its eyes will help convey useful information like changing direction and other actions while at work. It also comes with some redesigned end effectors, or hands, that should make it easier to pick up the plastic totes used inside warehouses. While it can walk, step up on curbs, crouch, and perform other simple actions, its main function is to pick up and put down various types of objects weighing up to 35 pounds. E-Spear Introducing the Ocean Guardian E-Spear powered by Shark Shield technology the world's only scientifically proven and independently tested electrical shark deterrent technology. It is designed to reduce the risk of an unwanted shark encounter. The e-spear is primarily designed for spearfishers who whilst aware of their surroundings, are wanting to protect their catch and themselves from overly inquisitive sharks. These are a more reactive and targeted approach to dealing with sharks in the water compared to the Ocean Guardian Freedom 7. Sharks have short-range electrical receptors in their snouts used for finding food. Shark Shield technology is used to create a powerful three-dimensional electrical field which causes spasms in these sensitive receptors turning sharks away. There are no known long-term harmful effects on sharks, fish, or humans. ProDrone PD-6BA Arm ProDrone Company Limited is pleased to announce it has developed the PD-6BAW arm, a large-format drone equipped with two internally developed robotic arms, enabling it to directly accomplish a variety of tasks. The PD-6BAW arm is based on ProDrone's large-capacity PD-6BAW airframe, which has a maximum payload of 20 kg 44 pounds. For the new model the company's development team designed, produced and attached two high-performance, completely original 5-axis robotic arms. They give the drone versatility to perform across a wide range of situations. The robot arms can carry a maximum payload of approximately 10 kg 22 pounds, and with flight time of up to 30 minutes, this drone can also excel at longer tasks. The Cryptite Sneaker The Cryptite sneakers are predominantly designed to show off Centratex's S2-3D printing system, as well as the company's rubber-like TPE elastomer material. Thinner structures are very flexible, while thicker ones can absorb considerably more energy before bending, hence the top of the shoe is super thin and perforated for breathability, while the sole is more structural, designed specifically to cope with expected forces generated by walking and running. 
Henrik separates out all five toes on the plated sole design, each able to roll forward to create the impression of a sharp claw. Your footprints in dirt or sand will therefore make people wonder whether Bigfoot's been in the neighborhood, and that's indeed what gave the cryptides their name, a cryptid is a mythical beast. Acer ABI Acer is branching out into the e-bike market with the launch of a new model called the ABI. While the company is known for its PCs, the innovative e-bike leads with a technologically advanced yet minimalist design, featuring a powerful electric motor, airless tires made from recycled materials and collision detection sensors for added safety. Weighing in at about 35 pounds with a 250-350W, the ABI converges speed, smart technology and smartphone compatibility in the single motorbike. The ABI is equipped with a range of tools for additional protection, including an anti-theft alarm and auto-lock function that kicks in when the linked phone is out of range. A single charge takes around two and a half hours and can provide up to 70 miles of battery life. HRO The HRO is a data collector from the air. It can be equipped with various sensors and cover different areas of application. Possible areas of application are observation fire monitoring, environmental damage, agricultural cultivation, etc. Industrial inspection bridges, tunnels, monument protection and industrial plants, etc., and monitoring of large areas. Digitalization also plays a major role, the launcher systems are connected to the internet and are able to perform autonomous flight sequences, whether via WLAN or mobile networks. Thomas Firewater Containment The firewater barrier, certified by TV and produced according to VDS guidelines, consists of a metal, multi-chamber profile barrier which is thermally and mechanically resistant. On either the left or right sides, the metal barrier is attached to a pivoting hinge. When open, the, the barrier's vertical positioning is spatially economical. Upon activation of a button, sensor or other close command as well as in cases of power loss, the barrier begins a slow, controlled swing downwards to its closed position. The 90 degrees closing process is driven by pneumatic cylinders. When the barrier has reached its closed position, it is lowered by the hub hinge and permanently locked into place by a pneumatic clamp. Resetting to the open position occurs automatically following the push of a button. Unlocking of the clamps and resetting of the barrier to its open position is carried out automatically by the pneumatic cylinders. <laughs>